So what do you do during the times um, when things don't go according to plan? Like what does Elise do to kind of get refocused? You know, when you don't get the role or you don't, you know, actors don't show up on time, you know, with those films that you're doing. And, and so what do you do in those times? You mean every day? <laughs> Yes, <laughs> because that's the everyday thing. And that's the thing that people who need to understand. If you wanting to be an actor, you got to understand it's a constant rejection. And I'm going to bring it right back to what I said. Being a person who was a musical theater person first really prepared me for this because, you know, as a musical theater performer, we would go to auditions all day. You dance all day. Then they be, be sweating. <laughs> and be like, okay, well, we're only gonna call back these 20 people. So you'd be like, okay. Then you do the call back. And then there's a whole nother combination. So you one, two, three, and four. Learn a whole nother combination. Okay. Okay, we're gonna cut it to five. Okay. <laughs> and you five need to go, oh, get your song ready. Okay. Go in the back, try to wipe all your sweat off. Okay, sing your song. Uh -huh. Okay, we're only gonna pick two people. <sighs> and then you go home. And then you do it all over again. And then you do it all over again. And then you do it all over again. There's a constant buildup of rejection. And then you decide to be an actor. It's still the same thing. It's, it's rejection. And you have to understand that that is part of the gig. I learned a long time ago, I've been doing this like 27 years, that that's part of the gig. I learned that as a dancer, it's part of the gig. I don't get wrapped up in that. If they want me, they want me. If they want long legs, that ain't me. I can't get wrapped up in that. I just got to find the other job. It's just that simple. So I think me being a person who loves to create helps me with that. Because I'm either TikToking or I'm going to create a dance or I'm going to do a dance or I'm going to find some way or I created my the PSA about um domestic violence. I find ways to feed my creative soul no matter what, because it's part of me. It's part of me and who I am and been that way for since I was six years old. So 